Good day everybody and welcome to the channel. Thank you very much for joining us today. Please subscribe. We see a lot of people coming into the channel and not going doing anything. We need to give things away. That's that's our pledge. We want to give the EX30 away. We want to give some charges away. We want to give some merchandise away, but we need your help. So please, please subscribe as we, we need the subscribers to, to come on board. So today I really hope that I'm going to let you guys save money. That that's the whole that's the whole idea. And what we're going to do, we're roughly looking here in South Africa. We're probably looking at about a forty thousand rand save. Wow! So that that shows you how expensive it is. It, it's around about quoted at thirty thousand rand for the box with Volvo. So you guys are going to save a lot. That that's that's my goal. And not only that, it's going to be portable. It is almost like you will be able to charge anywhere in South Africa and you will be charging as the same as what a box do. A box is normally coming, if we do speak about Volvo's box, you're probably looking at the same at the same scenario. That's that's the only thing is, but you, uh, the only difference is you, you here you will be able to take the, the technology with you. That That's the awesomeness about it. When you do get home, I've got a nice setup at home. When you do get home, then you've you 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 have got your 32 amp wire that's obviously pulled through by an electrician, and um, that blue socket, that blue socket that you see here is the one is the one that you will that you will be um, putting in there that you obviously will need to get done by an electrician. If you don't feel safe, you can do this on your own, but it's probably best to to contact the electrician. But I mean, not everybody is screwed up. I mean, I can. Let's let's take Andre as an example. I mean, if Andre, if I ask you a 32 amp, how many kilowatts is it? I don't know. No clue. No know. clue. <laughs> exactly. So you're not alone. <laughs> so unfortunately, it is what it is. We we're not all clued up with. It's a lot of mathematics. We're all not clued up all with electricity. But what I'm going to discuss today is I'm going to show you what I've actually done. I've actually basically taken the normal 32 amp. And I've converted it into a 16 amp type of setup so that you will be able to plug it anywhere in South Africa. Because as you can see with their charger, that's coming in at about 5,000 Rand. That, that's just that's how affordable it is. Good quality. Not a thing of any funny business going on. It's, it's really good quality. Yeah. As you can see here, Andre, I don't know how your feeling is when you saw that, but it looks well put in together. Yeah. It's, it's no weird, you, you cannot see anything clearly or anything like that. It's got a digital screen, you can change your current, you can play around, you can do all of these things. So, and, and that's that's the biggest point. This this technology that, that we've got here, that's now the, the, the 16 amp and then obviously the 32 amp. So I've basically converted the, the, the 16 and I converted it into, uh, or the, or the, I converted the 32 into the 16 so that you can charge anywhere in South Africa. That's basically a, a 32 amp plug, that blue, don't worry, it's not, it's not three phase or anything. I know it looks hectic, but it's normal 220, so, or then 230. That, that goes, goes in together. So this one goes into the 32 amp and that will make it that you can charge anywhere in South Africa. That, that's the, the biggest thing. And in case you do forget, if you do forget your things on, there's a little circuit breaker. You can go on Amazon or you can contact your, your local electrician. They should be able to get a little device. We got this from ACDC uh, that is basically normally come on generators. So that will trip. Immediately when you do, when, when you pull too much current, it will trip just for safety. Just in case your house should trip anyway if you do if you do uh, uh, pull too much current from from your circuit breaker, but if you want to take extra precaution, it's rather better. I promise you. I think for for 16 amp, rather be safe. It's still at 3.5, 3.4 kilowatts of energy that you will be able to put into the car. And don't worry, you do not charge your electric vehicle overnight every night. Please, people, I think there's so much education that needs to be done in South Africa. People is still having the wrong concept of electric cars. We, your, your stove or your aircon is probably taking more energy than your electric car. On average, we, we use between 10 and 20 kilowatts per day. And look, there's a lot of people solar out there, so that does, doesn't even matter to them. On the, on the end of the day, it's important that this technology that I'm showing today, 
is, is basically making life easier. That, that's what I'm trying to do. For the first time, you can actually take your box, call it your box if you want to. You can actually take it with you. But Andre, thank you very much for joining me today. And look out for our content coming up with all kinds of uh, and, uh, long trips that we're planning to do. And we will be seeing you in the next one. Thank you very much.